things I like most about Google Plus is the ability to use the search function within it to find people that might be looking for your services or your products, people that are talking about you, people that are talking about your industry, and even those who might influence the decision of your audience and your customers. So today I'm going to show you how to find these people on Google Plus and what you should do once you have found them. To search Google Plus, it's very similar to searching Google. All you need to do is type your search term into the bar at the top here. So it's a sunny day in Ireland, so I'm going to search for Holiday Ireland. And straight away you can see it's brought up a selection of posts regarding holidays in Ireland. And it's showing me the best, so it's showing me the ones that have the most interaction on them. I can change that and look at the most recent. Now say I wanted to get rid of St George's Day from my search. I can go back into my search bar and put in minus and put it in quotation marks so it takes the whole quote and then hit search again. So that should eliminate any mentions here of St George's Day and as you can see, yes the post has gone. Now it's searching everything, so you can see here it's offering me peoples and pages that are related to holidays in Ireland. Um, I can also see trending topics, now this isn't specific to my search at all, it just happens to appear there. I can look at people or pages, so there's a whole host of people I could be following if I wanted a holiday in Ireland. I can look at communities, if I look at instead of holiday Ireland and see if I can get Irish tourism, and I'll get rid of this St George's Day operator and just search for Irish tourism. And as you can see, there's a couple of larger communities here that would definitely be worth getting involved in. As you can see, they've got a significant number of members and a significant number of posts. So this is a place where I could network with other people that have an interest in Ireland and Irish tourism. Now I can go into Google Plus Posts. This works in a very similar way to Twitter search. So as you can see, there's posts coming up here. Um, this one from the 19th of April, and you can see it's got a lot of activity around it. This post is from a guy called David Booskill, and he's a travel writer. So he's definitely somebody I would want to connect with if I was in the tourism industry. And the nice thing about this is like Twitter, I can just jump in and I can leave my own comments as well. Don't forget though that Google Plus always brings up the best of search first. So have a look at most recent. And what I can see here is that Dave is still at the top of my search list here. And he's still in Ireland or he was at 7.26 a.m. yesterday. So it might be worth sparking a conversation with him if I had a tourism business near um, the Cliffs of Moa or if I had a tourism business in Ireland altogether. He'd definitely be one to add to a circle. 